Hello, I am David W. Parker. This is Programming Today I Learned, WebGL series, episode 40. We're going to be looking at scaling in two dimensions. So, just like everything else, but we're going to use matrices today. Just like before, we have x prime and we have different sets of equations we need to set up. Before, for these, we had s of x times x, s of y times y is equal to y prime, s of z times z is equal to z prime. And given our matrices that we know after multiplication, this is what the table looks like. So you can clearly see that a is going to be equal to s of x, so those are multiplied out, and all of these are going to be 0, so b, c, and d are 0. Similarly, y, uh, f will be s of y, so we'll have this equation to solve for, and e, g, and h will all be 0, so on and so forth. And then finally, so everything else is 0, and then p is equal to 1, such that this equation is also satisfied. So this is what our overall matrix, matrix, matrix is going to look like down the main diagonal here, and then a 1 at the end. So glancing over here on our index, we scroll down to the bottom, we can see here where we go ahead and set up our scaling matrix. Again, here's the identity matrix set up with all 1s. So we have this very small triangle here that is 0.25 and 0.25 on either side. If we go ahead and scale this out now, though, and we go ahead and comment this code, we can see that we're going to multiply the x and the y axes by 2. We're not scaling the z's at all. And so both of these sides are going to double in length. So once we go ahead and save that, you can see now we're twice as long on each of these axes. If we decided to not scale the y axis and just scale the x axis, you can see that that x uh, axis is, uh, excuse me, the y axis remains the same and the x-axis is doubled in size. So that's it for scaling with matrices. Uh, if you like what you saw today, go ahead and subscribe. Uh, go to uh, Programming TI Dell and sign up for my newsletter. Uh, like us, share us on social media, and uh, we'll see you next time. Thank you.